The Swiss culture founder of Teenage Adult was born in Toulouse on 22 May 1925. He was the only child of factory worker and his wife. As a child, he was a poor student and an avid reader and spent much of his free time perched in a tree flipping and reading. He created his first example of kinetic, kinetic art at the age of 12 and still felt in the 1980s that this was his best effort in motion art. After going to school, he began his training as a shop windows decorator in a department store in 1940. Then he studied at the Kohn's Art School in Basel from 1941 to 1945 a period during which he discovered the art of the board of and grew as well as becoming any enthusiastic fan of the boards. Tingeli first tried to create art with paint and canvas but could not ever finish a painting. He always wanted to add something more. That's why he began experimenting with movement, movement space. space in 1944 with his machine sculptures by equipping them with electric, electric motors, motors and making them spin around at high speed. Moving on, he speared him to finish his pieces of art. He moved to Paris in 1951, where he participated in Robert Rochambeau's international happening and signed up in the cultural artists group Nouveau Realiste, showing works in their exhibition. He had his first one-man exhibition three years later, in 1954, at the Galerie Arnaud. Jean Tingeli exhibited the works at the Biennale in Paris in 1959, and the time associating himself with the group Zero. The artist international fame came around the mid-1960s, if not earlier. He showed works at the Document Park in 4 and 6 in Basel between 1964 and 1977. In 1991, the yard of Count Hausian Museum was, that was opened. It was Condor Vassar's desire to begin the series of international, international special, special exhibition. exhibition with the Jean Tingeli exhibition Narte Chaten Gevach in the Council's Vienne was its last exhibition in this lifetime. Nowadays, Tingeli Tingeli Museum, Museum in Basel is emblematic location of the artist world. From an early age, Jean Tingeli has always been captivated by the onset of the mechanical, mechanical movement. movement. In 1955, the series Meta Machine, Pain Canvases, is a travesty, travesty of, of minimalist, minimalist abstract, abstract art. Meta Malevich Relief is a series, series of sculptures, sculptures Tingeli executed between 1954 and 1955. The series is over 20 works. It is composed of a black wooden box with seven rectangular white painted metal elements. In the box, there is wooden wheels, rubber belts, metal rods, and electric motor. The wheels and belts all have different sizes and turn at different speeds. This provides endless, endless possibility, possibility of, of combination, combination for his Meta Thing Lee once gushed to a viewer of his works. Each will take at least 10,000 years for this extraordinary new machine to repeat before our eyes the same composition. Ting Lee saw this series of paintings as a tribute to Casimir Malevich, main painter from the constructivist movement in the early 20th century. Indeed, with its series of Meta Malevich, the Swiss artist wants to use the geometry of Malevich works to push, push the art even further. further. A moving painting, painting, which forms move and where the artistic composition of the paint is changing, where a per perpetual motion of Malevich's lines and polygons constantly creates new, new composition, composition with mechanical and, and random, random movements. Tingley wants to create an, an endless, endless piece of art. art. Meta Malevich series foreshadows another series of meta, meta mechanics, or meta -ergo, which will constantly show us the interest Tingley had to make static, static art, art moving and changing. Jean Tingley later perfected his machines while assembling junk collected anywhere 
and make sculpture value best. Subsequently, the artist will participate in events from New York to Copenhagen. These creations are Still really staging. staging. Hingley highlights the technical knowledge that has developed since the beginning of these creations. Its buildings smoke, smoke explode, explode, destroy, destroy themselves, themselves, such as the work La Vittoria, pre presented in Milan in 1970. Tingley invents the, the mechanical, mechanical appeal. appeal. Rotozaza. Appear in 1967, the series Rotozaza, number series played with balloons, the second case of beer cans, and finally the third break plates. Then a Rotozaza number two. Materials and techniques used in its creations are of welded scrap metal, plexiglass, bicycle chains, as well as electric motors and other metal components. In October 1967, Tingley get another opportunity to express their ideas on the same theme of overproduction. Indeed, he was invited to a Congress of Futurology standing in New York for the occasion of the Congress on Communication in a Changing World. Jean Tingley presents some 300 participants to destroy in smashing beer bottles, a real mechanical appeal. An assembly directs bottles of beer to a big hammer that routinely breaks. Sometimes beer squirts and pieces of glass to fly in into the room. When Ting Lee believes he communicates his message, he addressed the audience. Thank you for having the patience to let me tell you my story. In addition to filling the taste of the game by a state of well-being playful, and participatory women's machines, Rotozaza intend to reveal the contrast between industrial machinery, useful and productive, and Tingley's machines, whose production limited exclusively to the concept of art. They are machine sculptures that deal with the overproduction of industrial society, which inevitably flow from the more or less necessary products requiring the attention of the consumer. The second approach that we will do this work of Gentingly will replace it at a time when industrialization is becoming more present with a lot of infernal machines, the fast pace of life and therefore new sound. The second approach we will have is that the work of Gentingly will replace it at a time when industrialization is becoming more present with a lot of infernal machines, the fast pace of life, and therefore new sounds. Poor and third, even if only once in his life, in a weaving factory, a chain of automotive, noisy image of the machine is necessary to prohibit over the communication of gesture. Mechanism are not hidden, not killed, but instead put forward in their movements, in their functions. It follows the look on each wheel, each transmission, including reports, easy movements, sound production, as a basic principle of cause and effect, without any artifice that the meeting of the mechanical elements creating an acoustic universe visible and understandable by any observer listening. In the 70s, Tingley sculptures up on rails, on scales, later still, the machine stingly kept feathers, skulls, and adds bulbs. New Star 2174 number 2. This is a sculpture which has probably the best influence. It is inspired by Marcel Duchamp's ready made sculptures, everyday tools transformed as a pieces of art, and Tingley, true to his work on beliefs, decided to add motion to Duchamp's works. We can see a piece of wood holding a clamp and a drill with a broom instead of a drill bit. The sculpture has two main colors, blue with a few strokes of paint on the piece of wood and clamp, and the red for the duster. 
Maybe this piece of art makes us think about the established framework of the family in the 1670s. Thierry also took two perfectly functional items to create an object that is still usable but not functional anymore. It is a deconstruction destruction of the mass consumer's items. Beauty evolves in, in Hungary from a combination of the ugly, as his works are not even high polish. They work despite the anachronistically unfunctional appearance and the shabbiness of their components and thus become a double parody of a high-tech environment. They are not only pure projects of art without a function, but at the same time caricature of traditional concept of beauty which indispensably demands a highly polished, smooth exter exterior. In the years that followed, Jean Tingeli makes most of these works with his woman Niki de Safa, the confrontation of two styles of two worlds that created a unique work as we show the work of Stravinsky Fontaine. 